Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome hey back. Guys. Welcome back to the Rideshare Hub. In today's video, we are going to do a how to set up your dash cam because it's super important as Uber drivers that you need to have a dash cam just in case. Yeah, for your safety. So here we have the Van True on dash N4 dash cam. This records the outside of the front. We'll have a I, I have a link below if you want to look at dash cams to buy, guys. Yeah. Um, and they're honestly not super expensive. They might cost you 50 bucks, 100 bucks, but it could save you thousands of dollars worth of damage in the event that you get into an accident or a passenger, God forbid, attacks you. You want to have this footage. Yeah, so we're going to show you how to install this camera. And this one goes front. It, it shows the outside and the inside, right? Yeah, and the back. There's yeah. your camera, so let's go. All right, so first things first, you need a micro SD card. So just put this in here. Also, I already did this, but you're supposed to attach this part. Um, yeah. That sticks it on. To oh, and then you twist the little twisty thing. Yeah. Yeah. So this records the outside. You have it here. Oh. You have a camera here that records the inside. So where do you want this? Like here? Oh, that's kind of annoying. Put it on the other side. So that way I don't have to like, so it's not yeah. going to block my Should I vision. Should on the other side then? I guess, yeah. Okay, we're going to stick it on here. And just lock it. And now it's in place. Like I can't pull it off at all. Perfect. All right, so we got Izzy doing cord running. So basically what we did is we, you once you install the cord in guys, you want to make sure you run it up through here over the... The windshield blocker thing and then we actually stuffed it in the trim here I don't know if you can see it but it goes inside that's the wire runs down here so it's hidden and then it goes all the way down and plugs in there so from up here you can't really see it that much but that's what it is right. and we got Izzy doing wiring back here this is to connect the rear camera because you connected from the front and you run it all the way to the back yeah I wish there was like an easier way to do this but... yeah literally don't break that either yeah does it look like it's like secure yeah the trim okay yeah guys the benefits of having a dash cam is in the event of an accident you can send this into your insurance company to show that you're not at fault and then if a passenger leaves you a false report you can send in footage that you that you were like not that you were sober or whatever or you weren't speeding yeah okay i don't really know what to do with the rest of this well it's fine because now it's just in the trunk yeah, so now where, you, where do you want to stick the camera you gotta stick it up here so you put the sticky thing like here oh. <laughs> all right and then you just want to plug it in. Plug it in, plug it in. Right here? Yeah. Here we go, guys. Setting it up now. We got power. Now we turn the car on. It's the 11. All right, guys. We got it all set up. As soon as you turn on your car, it automatically turns on. Okay? There's three different angles. The inside, the front, and the back. And you can just press this button here. And you can... Oh, that's the back? Yeah. Oh, so it's like tilted. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, we can move that later. And that's the front. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, guys, check it out. We'll have a link down below if you want to get this dash cam. It also records audio, which is important. You know, if any verbal disagreement happens in your car with a passenger. Make sure to like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below if you have a dash cam and be sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos from us anyways i'll see you in the next one bye